We must create a system that converts the current flow of primarily low-skilled illegal immigrants into the United States into a more manageable and controlled flow of legal immigrants who can be absorbed by our economy. For decades, the United States was operated and has operated a very low-skilled immigration system. This policy has placed substantial pressure on American workers, taxpayers, and community resources. When we use phrases like undocumented workers, we convey a message to the American people that their government is not serious about combating illegal immigration, which the American people overwhelmingly oppose. But we are a land of laws. We have borders. You said it. They're illegal immigrants. They're not supposed to be here. People who enter the United States without our permission are illegal aliens, and illegal aliens should not be treated the same as people who entered the U.S. legally. This legislation demonstrates our compassion for struggling American families who deserve an immigration system that puts their needs first and that puts America first. I say to you that the American people will never accept immigration reform unless they truly believe that their government is committed to ending future illegal immigration. And any successful comprehensive immigration reform bill must recognize this fact. I believe that real and positive immigration reform is possible as long as we focus on the following goals. To improve jobs and wages for Americans. To strengthen our nation's security. And to restore respect for our laws. We can use your help. Call your cable subscriber and kindly demand that One America News is added to your lineup. Call today.